Predators has changed. The objective was to fly to uh, Bembridge from Red Hill. So one of the things we need to do is look at the aerodrome information that's published on the NATS website. So if you look at the Red Hill aerodrome and click the link, it will open the plan for Red Hill aerodrome. And as you can see on here, it gives a graphical representation of the runway. In this case, we have runway 36. Um, and we can see other information pertinent to the aerodrome such as the magnetic variation and the um, communication frequency. Now let's go back to the index on this website and let's look for Bembridge. Unfortunately it doesn't seem to have any um, aerodrome information publications for, e for Bembridge. So I'm going to have to look elsewhere for that information. I mean, I did a search even for the code um, of the aerodrome and couldn't find anything. So let's look at the website itself for Bembridge Airport. And there you go, you can see some information. So there's a, a graphical, a photograph of, an aerial photograph of the actual aerodrome. With, um, the comms ID is 123.25 and the runway direction is 30 in one direction and 120 in the other direction so 300 three zero zero. and on this link we can see further information such as um, the QFE there's a circuit height of 1000 uh, feet above ground level you can see that it's an unlicensed airfield and that their runway directions are 300 and 120 degrees. It also tells us that prior permission is required for landing uh, well, during uh, the days of Monday to Friday. And the uh, days and hours on which uh, radio, Bembridge Radio is manned it tells us important information here that the circuits at Bembridge are always conducted on the north side of the airfield and will therefore be 30 right or 12 left as appropriate. Further information. So th thankfully they have a website with basic information that we can find which we couldn't find on the uh, aerodrome information publications list on that. Uh, little one four request to Western Hospital. Hello, one four tower to Western Hospital. 
was approved. Down. Oh, he's in the wind, yeah. Oh! Dead. What are you doing? Wait, you want to go? Not in the grass. No, in the grass. Okay. I thought I said that yesterday, didn't I? Don't go in the grass. Oh, it's going to be. Rain, you cannot go on the grass. Okay. It all slopes down, let all the water stand. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so power checks. Location positioned into wind. All temperatures within limits. Magnetos on both. RPM set 1700. A power to heat. Magnetos left and right. Ammeter charging. All in temperatures within limits. RPM set to 500, 700. Wide or high. Then to 1200. Okay, remember, set for takeoff. Total friction map, finger tight, extra rich. Magnetos on both. Master switch on, pitot heater is required, primer in and locked. And fuel check. Um, apps as required. These instruments and gauges. So Q and H1023 and the compass. Two, zero. And harness is secured. Carburetor to heat set cold. Controls full and free movement. Transponder fault. Okay. Clearances for runway line up. Okay. Departure is going to be changed because it's B6, isn't it? So, yeah. what, what uh, departure you got, Buckland? Yeah. Right, so you're gonna, we're going to go out towards this one, change the runways. We'll be going out on. Uh, then on 360, we'll probably tell you to go to the uh, motorway junction. Okay. So, the motorway junction, you'll have to fly uh, about 270 to Milford. So, you have to do, to do that as a diversion and okay. then do your proper heading from Milford. Yep. So I'll just say, um, 12 China November, departure. Just say, you'll say, just say, Golf Tone are holding at. Uh, holding at, yeah. Tell you one move departure, and he'll tell you what departure. It might be north of Rygate, okay. which means you go off towards uh, Nutfield Pry and go left. Otherwise, it'll be uh, the junction. So ask him what he said, and then we'll look at it when he tells you what he said. Okay. Golf Charlie November, holding at Charlie 1, uh, ready for departure. Got Charlie November Tower, Roger, hold position after departure, route via North Right Gate, climb, maintain altitude 1,400 feet. Route via North Right Gate, uh, hold altitude at 1,400 feet. Golf Charlie November. Golf Charlie November Tower, line up runway 36. Line up 
runway 36, Golf Channel, November. Golf Unit 4, Fox Trot Tower, no known traffic to effect, Chad to the west, and uh, basic service report leaving the frequency. Roger, we'll leave the frequency now, we're off the far and uh, that's 12525, Golf Channel, Golf Channel, Golf Channel, Golf Channel, Golf Channel, Golf Golf Charlie November Tower, runway 36, you are cleared for takeoff, service in 3606 knots. Clear for takeoff, runway 36, Golf Charlie November. Because it's a wet runway, it's giving you a chance to do a soft takeoff, okay? okay. So you'll need to pull the control back, get straight, heels on the floor, all power, flat pass, all well. So as soon as the airplane wants to fly off, you need to relax the back pressure, let it fly level and then back again, okay? Right up. Otherwise it will just get stuck in the ground. Speed is increasing. Yeah, come out to 50 knots. Okay, let's go. So just let, let the plane fly off. Then relax the back pressure, let yeah. it fly off. Relax the back pressure, let it fly. Down to 60. Just head towards an uphill car, okay? Okay. Okay, just start about this heading about uh, 340, be right. 340. Oh, the power is there, okay? Yeah, so we're going between the power and right gate. Okay, okay, just head out. And I'll tell you when to turn for uh, like, uh, Guildford. Climbing. Hey, just climb up, but you're avoiding my gate, okay? Okay. of uh, Woking yet? Yeah. Yeah? Oh. 400 feet, level up. What was your heading towards, Gilbert? What was the heading we wanted, first one? First heading was... Uh, three the... Okay, so if you look at uh, where Woking is, you know that Guildford is south of that, so you've got to 306 now, okay, 301. Where's Guildford then in relation to those towers? To the south there, yeah? Oh, 306. That's the eye right. That's not the right heading, is it? What's the first? That heading is from Buckland to uh, somewhere else, isn't it? I mean, we don't have Buckland. That was Redfield to Buckland. Yeah, so just forget about that heading. Okay. Give me a heading towards uh, Gilbert. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So just land to fight Gilbert. We'll do the heading from there. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. 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 Y
Bravo radar, this is Golf Bravo Mike Charlie November, requesting a basic service. Golf Bravo Mike Charlie November, Bravo radar, pass your message. Cessna 152, um, almost at Guildford, uh, QNH 1023. Um, Red Hill, oh sorry, altitude 1,800 feet. Red Hill to uh, Red Hill, oh, Red Hill to Denbridge, sorry. Golf Charlie November, Golf Bravo Mike Charlie November. Golf Charlie November, Squawk 0464, basic service, farm boot QNH 1024. Squawk 0464, QNH 1024, Golf Charlie November. Uh, on the radar, this is Golf Charlie Bravo Whiskey Delta, requesting frequency change to um, Leon Solon. 118-925 Whiskey Delta Squawk 7000, how are you? Squawk 7000, goodbye, Golf Charlie Bravo Whiskey Delta Farm Boot Uniform Tango, just Matt Shorty, we'd like to change the red door, 196 Golf Uniform Tango, Squawk 7000, goodbye 7000, thanks, Golf Tango Farm Boot Uniform Tango, Golf Charlie Golf, could you repeat the squawk for me? A Charlie, Golf Charlie Golf, Squawk 0463 Two zero four six three, got carried off. Sorry. What?
Here you can see a path to Long Hill. Three protector, uh, either retain Squawk, free call say at 120225 or Squawk 7000 and free call uh, direct. All right. Not from Alpha for Mike. Go for Alpha one. Like, uh, either retain Squawk, free call it to Sonic, 120225 or Squawk 7000. I forget what you want to say Bye. Bye. Now this should, should be a seal this on your yeah, zero four nine. Nine. now, which one goes off to the right, isn't it? Here's the other one, 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 that's okay. That uh, was the There's a plane on your left. That helicopter should have. Yep. Yep. Uh, that's fine, Don't stand on here, then. Are you going to make a correction for halfway, then? Two one, I'll one. I'll make a correction just by looking at it. You've got to tell me what you're going to do. Halfway. Well, that should be. There's a mask. Isn't it? There's a mask. So Pete's field is in front of the radar. And when you get to Pete's field, then you're going to be changing. You're going to be jumping out of the way. You're going to be jumping out of the way. You're going to be jumping out of the way. What's that water there? Cool. Oh, no, you've got a map. Yeah. Um, go, folks, drop up at the 
Uh, Alpha, we'll go 60, change to Blackbush, uh, yeah, Blackbush is light on 122, doesn't want to read. Alpha, Scorch 7000, mate. Scorch 7000, thank you, go see Alpha. We look like we're on track to me, I don't know. Anyway, if you're happy with it, yeah? Yeah. Have a look. Good afternoon, this is Golf Oscar Zulu Oscar Dim. Last station. Golf Oscar Zulu Oscar India. Golf Oscar Zulu Oscar India, far away, that's our message. Golf Oscar India, that's the 182, just crossing the A34 at King Clear. 3000 feet, heading 050. I have a five and five, just had to come to the other. So we're working uh, now by Wickham to L3, 47,000 for basic service. Someone else might be going on the way and they might be able to tell us what wrong with you. Okay. 
Yeah, I'll climb to 2,500 feet from here. Uh, you came here? Yep. Okay. Got the high, haven't we? Yep. Got the cloud.
Two high, we're only about 1,000 feet over that runway. Turning left now. What's the heading? Um, zero three. Coming in 
high like that, the only thing you can do is go round. Yeah. Try and try and force it down, get in, you'll go around, that's it. Right, so you've got to get in your head, you're high, on that position, you'll go around, right? Yeah. Okay, so you can see the Land the bridge. Wait. How high are we? What are we going to do? Big power up. Flat power off. Too high. Got to work quicker. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, we're going So what we're going to do? Yeah, stay low on. Right, 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 right there, yeah. Power's off, let the plane fly. No rush. Control it. Let the plane fly. Don't let it fly, don't let it land. Don't let it land. Got a tailwind as well, so let it fly, let it fly, no rush. Right, let it slow down, let it... Pull back. Giving you a tailwind. Middle of both of them. So you, you can't keep it flying until you're ready to fly because you've got a tailwind, it's going to be fast anyway. So you just got to keep it. And then try and land at that nose wheel. We don't want to be uh, on there too much. Runway, so we're trying to just park close to the edge. We're oh, I'm uh, just joining the runway at uh, the 1 2 uh, departure point. Thank you, Uncle Ralph. I'm uh, 
landing up in Waiting 1-2. So here, one of the great things about the Garmin D2 Pilot, um, oh sorry, the Garmin D2 Charlie watch for pilots, is the data that it records. So have a look here. This is the Garmin Connect app. It syncs the data from your phone, uh, which it captures during the flight. So once you, anyway, here, here's the route you can see on the map that I took from Red Hill. You can see the altitude I've flown, the heart rate measured during the flight, because the watch has a heart rate monitor um, and also the n amount of miles flown and the average speed and so on it's all captured here excellent bit of information so you can analyze your flight which is what I'm doing here so this flight from Red Hill to Brembridge can be seen on the map and it can actually replay the flight for you so you can see at different stages of the flight what altitude I was flying which direction I turned so you can see as I'm approaching Brembridge Here's what happened. I flew overhead, orbited twice, and landed. The reason I had to orbit was because um, there was a plane in front uh, having difficulty landing. There was a strong wind that day, I have to admit. And uh, yeah, you can see, so I can zoom in onto the map and you can see how I, um, following the instructions from the AIP, which I showed at the beginning of the video, you can see I approached um, Bembridge airfield overhead follow the left hand pattern joined on to uh, crosswind downwind base and did a go round on, on, on final approach and it, so there you can see two sort of circles um, so coming overhead Excellent bit of information captured from the flight. You can see how as I came from overhead I reduced alti altitude to reach the circuit pattern. Descended even further on final approach but then had to ascend um, on commencing the go around then coming back to final again all the way to land. Excellent information. Well, that's it from me. Thank you very much for watching and uh, stay tuned. I'll upload more as my P as I progress towards my PPL. Thank you.